I have had visual impairment for most of my life. However, in 2002, it started deteriorating quite rapidly. As my eyes deteriorated, I realized that I couldn't depend on my family and friends constantly to take me out, to be with me, to supervise me. So I, I knew then it was time to go and visit the doctors and see if I could actually get any help. Doctor I went to see, fabulous. Um, she referred me then to the social services. They got in touch with me and they actually got me a contact with a lady called Angela Edmonds. She's the visual rehabilitation officer for the Vale of Glamorgan within social services. So by the time I met Angela, I was at a very low point in my life as not only was I suffering with the loss of vision, but I'd also then developed skeletal problems. She started seeing me weekly, always had a plan of action, always positive with me. And I suppose the first thing that she started to do with me was to get me off the settee and to walk from the settee to the kitchen. So what Angela then did for me was to get me involved with the physiotherapists, occupational therapist, and they all came to the house. They all set me different tasks and provided me with items all through the Vale of Glamorgan, all providing me with items to enhance my life. Without Angela getting all these people involved, I would just have been carrying on being lifted in, being helped up and um, feeling sorry for myself. With all the professionals that were coming in, I was starting, although I wasn't physically running around, I was mentally improving, physically improving, but still really depressed that I wasn't improving as quick as I wanted to. Going for coffee every day, that was my life. It just so happened that I was observing these dogs and, and, and owners, you know. My uncle and his wife were down from Australia. And then they were saying something about all of these cafes in um, Australia. Dog cafes. Well, I heard that, dog cafes. I just thought, my God, is that something I can do here? And I told, told Angela about what I wanted to do. Well, that was it. Angela being Angela, referred me to the RNIB, where I met this marvelous young lady called Helen. Well, again, nothing was too much for Helen. Told her what I wanted to do. She was constantly in touch with me. So here I am, this is where I've ended. The birth of K9 plus one, it's the Vale of Glamorgan's first and only dog-themed coffee shop. And this is the future of myself from being somebody at the pits of despair to giving up on life totally, to now having a life and having my family, my friend involved. I couldn't be happier, but I could not have done this without Angela Edmonds, without Helen from the RNIB and without my best, wonderful friend, Annie.